Hello everybody, how's it going? I hope you're doing well. I'm doing pretty good. Uh, this episode was supposed to go up yesterday, but I was extremely sick and I couldn't upload anything, I couldn't record anything. Uh, but here I am, and I'm here to make up for it, but I have my own recording schedule for today. So, in order to make up, and at the same time not overwork, and not overload you guys with material, I'm gonna do like a semi-shorter episode instead of like... 45 50 minutes that it turns out to be usually I'm gonna try to do like a 20 minute episode if I can uh, But welcome to my channel or welcome back and welcome or welcome back to distant star round and fleet We're gonna continue our manic elite adventure and um, Stay alive, you know do everything we can to Stay alive <laughs> uh, I, I really don't think that we are going to uh, see the uh, air Baris platform in our current condition uh, but I am looking forward to a uh, brand new adventure after this one ends where I'm gonna be making a lot better decisions and I know a lot more about the game now that I can that I knew it ever before and and I can apply all this knowledge and uh, the, the stuff that the developers help have helped me with and given me tips about and and have a much better future run with it basically but uh, what is happening here it looks like a cargo pod that we're gonna we're gonna escort. You receive a priority message from High Command. War Leader! A factory is in, in this system where man, uh, manufacturing an expensive new alloy. Three times st stronger than our toughest material. Protect the cargo vessel as it loads up so the alloy can be delivered to Aos safely. Uh, Aos is like my home planet. It's very important to do this for Aos and. Um, I don't know if I if I attempt to scare the Orthani away. I'm afraid I'm not going to get anything from the cargo ship. Let's just protect the cargo ship and, and hope for the best. It's probably going to make uh, a couple of pit stops as enemies spawn. It's a good time to load up my shield for puffer sh puffer fish. And not forget about that. Uh, okay, Where, are you gonna turn? Sweet. I was more worried about this guy just ramming into this wall and blowing up than enemies coming. <laughs> I was more worried about the guy's horrible driving skills than anything else. I have a bad feeling about this. Because I should. This is, this is awesome here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so happy. Yeah, we have enough supplies to escape in case somebody was close to getting a critical damage. I'm not, I can't afford another critical damage on any of my ships. I've had enough of critical damage. Oh, shit! They're coming from behind. Alright, so are you gonna stop moving, please? And let me figure out what's happening exactly. Shit. Okay. You stay here. You stay here. You two, I need you kind of like further away from everything else, but still within range. Faster speed, I need you to protect him right now. Or you know what? No. Let's do this. I'm gonna make everybody stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Uh oh man, so many things over here. And they all have shields, they all have everything. That sucks. Attack that guy. Attack that guy. And uh, let's increase the power of our people. And uh, you two. Let's just ruin this guy, basically. Oh no. What's gonna happen to Puffer to um Moon Tiger? Okay, so we have the two lances. This guy takes a lance. And then this guy takes a lance. He's too close to me. I don't like enemies that are so close to me. Attack these butt butts. I uh, give shield to him.
This looks pretty possible. Are you are you targeting the right guy? Yeah, I'm targeting this guy. There you go. Um. Yeah, I think we got this. Lance, Lance, for sure. I wonder if that's gonna get him killed. That might. So in that case, why don't you uh, attack this guy? You attack that guy. I'm gonna give you shield. Oh, you know what? No, I'm gonna give you uh, not the shield, the semi invulnerability. Then I'm gonna have you have everybody target you, and this should work out. Oh, so close to death. Kill him, please. Thank you. Uh, that guy is left with his buddy behind him, but they're both like pretty hurt. And are they in range? They are indeed, which is the best part about this. And Moon Tiger needs some shielding back, and that's probably gonna happen pretty soon. That guy's almost dead. Uh, you two are targeting the same guy, right? Yes, you are. Um, let's lance this guy. What's my angle? Your angle, if I lance him over here, then it's gonna definitely... If it gets him, it'll pierce and hit that guy. And I want your fusion lance. Was it fusion? It is a fusion lance. To go from here... Yeah, here. Okay. And sure, increase your speed for attacking, and I'm gonna shield you immediately. First chance I get. Two... Before any hull damage occurs. Before any hull damage occurs, tell me that I'm able to actually heal you. And zappy zappy this guy. There we go. Perfect. Onwards! I'm ready. It's probably gonna be one more fleet of en enemies that'll spawn. And I'll deal with them. Gladly, I'll deal with them. And when did you take all damage, or did you get attacked by one of those weapons that deals haul damage as well as shield? I think that's what happened with him. He's kind of leaky again. You are leaky as hell. Oh shit, they're coming from over here. Oh, this big guy is a carrier. Gunship, gunship. Alright. So you need to be in front. You need to be over here. Alright, cool. They're still flying in. Now they stopped. Um, you're still moving over there. I'm going to have all fire directed on you. Then I'm gonna shield you up. And I think this guy is a legit worry. With most hauled, he's going to take the most amount of time to destroy. And he has a lot of. BS can oh my god, drone bay, drone bay, so many drones. Yes, you need to go quickly. Um, you guys, please target him faster. Okay, um, this is getting a little scary. Let's kill this big boy, and then we'll go ahead and attack. Actually, you know what? Let's focus on this guy. After him. 
And shielding. I need... I need you to come back! joking you're kidding me no 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 you buddy need to go You two, what am I what am I gonna have you do? You just have to hide. Where's the cargo? Safe and sound, just away from all this commotion. Look at all these explosions and stuff. Um so what am I looking at? I'm looking at a guy over here. Two guys down here. Not too bad. Uh I have to protect Moon Tiger. You're in imminent danger. Oh fuck, it's time to retreat. But what about the cargo? No, I gotta protect the cargo! Uh, let's reposition, at least. Okay. Oh god, this is so hairy. So hairy. Just get there, please. Just do it and please don't summon any other enemies. I beg of you. I am begging. Come here. Oh man, come on, 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 go, 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 go. Oh fuck. Oh shit, they're coming from over there too. Oh man. Okay, non shielded. Alright, we're gonna move in. I'm gonna move in over here. Wait. Why are you guys not able to reposition correctly? There we go. Uh, no, you actually need to go over here. You need to be here-ish. That's good. You guys are in a good position too. In fact, you two stop. No, just, just, just stop moving. This guy. Attack faster, be targeted. Shield him. Okay, um. What is this? What is that? What is... What is happening over there? Are you destroying my shields? You are. Oh, man. 
Stop right here. No, stop moving. You two need to get the hell out of there. You two need to get over here. Alright, we gotta get these lances fired at someone. You're gonna die. What do you have? You have a ton of ugly stuff, don't you? Ion storm generation. Alright, that guy's gonna go too. Um, what are you targeting? Doesn't look like you're targeting anything. We'll target this guy. How about fix up? Target that guy. You also target this guy. Oh shit, shields. Get him. Okay. Uh, so far, so okay. There are mines here. I don't want this mine to blow up in my face. Uh, Pufferfish has enough for shielding. That's good. Somebody's going to require saving at some time. Uh, you could afford getting shots directed onto you. In just a few seconds. Things are going okay. Um, two second one. Countdown to using the fusion lances on this big ass carrier and we're gonna be left with this one dude who is just persistently attacking my my convoy yeah. oh shit oh shit 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 move move guys gotta, gotta move you out of this uh, death zone that has been created go 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 fast Time to finish the job. This is it, you son of a bitch. You're going down so fast. We don't even know it. You don't even know it. Wow. Balls to the walls, and we finished it. And we don't get anything, do we? Not really. Do we? We do! Yes! Credits at least. The vital... This vital cargo will reach its destination safely. You might never meet the people who use it, but... You have protected them today. Oh, missile auto reloader too. Hello. Can I... Can I take a look? Sir. Um... So what does this do exactly? Increases the rate of fire of missile type weapons by 11%. Like this guy. Like the spider missiles here. Oh man. This targeting override scrap value is itself more than this. Um, but I think I am going to do with, do away with this. Simply because I have... I don't know.
Yeah. I think I'm gonna install this. Yeah, let's do it. Man, this is gonna be a risky move. I hope I'm making the right decision. See, but at the same time, this increases my resistance as well. Never mind, scrap. Man, I was so excited about that. I realize it's pretty much useless. Are we gonna make it to uh, Benares Collective? The Benares Collective is an uh, Elgani Manufacturing Collective allied to the Akari. At least for now. While the fickle Elgani trade agreements hold. Uh, so maybe, maybe there's something good over here. So let's see. Please don't, please don't attack me. Please let me just travel through the system. Casually... Casualty figures for the system are immense, though the war has moved on for now. There's nothing here but desolation. I'm okay with desolation. Desolation right now means good news for me. The danger level is already so high in the system, in this sector. You arrive to find a number of automated production factories controlled by the Elgani. After a short delay, the Overseer hails you. He seems flustered. Welcome, Commander. Rest assured, we have been working tirelessly to, to resupply your, your most glorious Akari Empire. Surely, you're not here to monitor our output. Well, I think this last line you just said here is a little suspicious, buddy. Why did you, why did you assume that? I'm sure your output is, is tolerable. I'm just here to purchase items for my fleet. Should I ask him to send me his figures, or should I just, uh... You know... This must be a difficult job. Let me give this man a break and go with option three. The overseer bows, though there is an insolent glint in his eye. Ah, yes, of course. I'm sure we can spare some of our valuable inventory for the great Akari cause. Of course you can. Plus, you are shady as hell. And uh, I changed my mind. I'm going to come back and ruin you. <laughs> Micro volatile storm, too. Woohoo. I don't have a take ship. Don't have rogue ship, don't have a carrier ship, right? So we're looking at uh, damaging pulse 3 and damaging pulse 2. Which I have had before. This is a uh, 72%. 5. This has a huge area of effect. But it's a four second charge time. So I need to remember that. So I can't get any of the, I don't really have a use for any of these. Um, I really don't, do I? I don't think so. It's like a tiny area of effect. It is a it is a slightly stronger, but like shorter range. Nah, I'm gonna stick with what I have. But I'll buy the supply from you. Thanks, boy. And, uh, could I re-ask you for the, the figures and numbers? You cheat. Yeah, cheat! You know what, this is within our reach, so let's go see what this is exactly about. This flight base coordinates most of the Akari military action in this sector. They also maintain large stores of attachments. Ooh! You know, if, if, if they sell attachments, then I want to go, like, all around and come back to him and then, like, leave the system because... So I want att attachments. I want to take a bunch of attachments. If they sell attachments, then I want them. The subspace transponder is broadcasting the temporary availability of a repair ship. So they can repair critical damage. So it's great. If I make this little arch over here and come back to this repair place, then I can definitely get my ships repaired from critical damage. Uh, along the way, I will have had... And get attachments. And, and along the way, I will have had an opportunity to see these two points. Uh, this one is... 
The Quana system is being used as a staging point for pulling back ships in a defense of Aos. There may be an opportunity to requis requisition ships from here. Oh. So, yeah. Um, definitely gonna check this one out too. And then this one. The emergency transponder on a cargo pod is broadcasting from this position. Hmm. So many good options, yeah. In the next episode, guys, I'm gonna go up here, check out what fleets are being sold here. Hopefully by then I'll have a ton of supplies. Enough to purchase a ship, actually, maybe. If I get like 3,000, 3,000, 3,000. About 9,000 extra. That might, that might allow me to get another ship if I sell one, maybe. We'll see. But yeah, I'm definitely gonna call an episode here. Thank you so much guys for watching. And I'm sorry about yesterday's uh, uploads not happening because I was so sick. Uh, but thank you for watching this episode. If you like this, please leave a th thumbs up. It would uh, help out a great deal. And thank you for your time and attention. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.